Hey, what is going on guys? Seth Carr back with another video and today is Wednesday and today I think I'm going to do a little Lego collection video. Uh, I know a couple people have been wanting me to do that. Uh, this video will not have an edit, it, edit in it, um, which kind of sucks because, you know, I don't have anything to edit with. I tried downloading stuff on my laptop and it just it's too slow, but actually before I do the Lego... There's the game capture card. Um, if you guys know how to update your driver for a laptop, like manually, just leave a comment down below for that. I have no clue on how to do that. I've looked it up, and it still won't really cooperate with me. But definitely let me know. Alright, let's get into this. So first we have the Lego DeLorean uh, from Lego Ideas set. It comes with Doc and Marty. Um, this honestly is a really cool set. I love it, obviously, because I bought it. And uh, that's just my annoying brother. So annoying. <laughs> I don't even know what he's singing. But anyways, here is the Lego Droid Carrier that came out in like 2013 that I bought. I bought most of these sets. Some of the sets I got from my parents, but uh, yeah. Next we have a... I'm pretty sure that's a gang, like a gangster, uh, no, it's a bounty hunter uh, gunship. As you can see, it's a bit broken. I just have to fix that. My brother broke it. But, uh, yeah. I'm not so sure what some of these sets are called, so if you know what they are, leave a comment down below. I'm still, I mean, I just bought this in the summer. I'm pretty sure it's like a Naboo Naboo Starfighter or something like that. I'm not so sure. It was only like $24 when I got it, so it's not bad. One of my favorite sets right here is the First Order Troop Transporter. And right there we have the First Order Battle Pack right in there. See, this set This set comes with four, trooper, four First Order Troopers. See them right in there. And it comes with Captain Phasma and two Rebel Soldiers. This comes with the two officers and... To, I'm pretty sure it comes with the two First Order troops, as you see there. Next, we have a mock, just a little swap mock I made. And next, we have the Cre Lego Creators set. It's a, it's like a mountain house. It comes with an eagle. It only comes with a quad and a guy. This guy right here in the middle. I just added these two guys for, like, you know, more crap. And next we have the Millennium Falcon from Star Wars The Force Awakens. This is a really big set. I got it for my birthday two years ago. Wow, it's been two years. It doesn't even feel like two years. I'm just fixing my camera if you saw that little jick right there. Wow, looks beautiful. Next, we have Anakin and Sebulba's Pod Racers. Uh, my friend actually gave this to me, so shout out to him. Uh, he doesn't have a YouTube or anything. I don't even think I'll see this, but... Yeah, it's a pretty... These. This is actually a really big set. And it came, it came with uh, Anakin, Sebulba, Obi-Wan, C-3PO. Or no, it didn't come with C-3PO. I think it came with R2-D2. And some other, I think it's like Greedo. I'm not even sure. I don't think it's Greedo, but I know it's like something related to him. Alright, next we have this little hoth thing I've made. Uh, it so basically, I'll explain this to you. This part over here was all one, or maybe it was this was a battle pack. And then this is one set. And then this is a separate set. This is when Luke was getting attacked, and he was hanging right up in there. His lightsaber's right there. I don't know if you can see it. It goes right in there, and it could shoot out to him. This was a... This is just a battle pack. I'm not sure. I can't remember. I got these forever ago, like in 2013. So, uh, yeah. Next, we have Jabba's Palace. I don't know if you can see Jabba the Hutt in there. This is the 2012 version. Oh yeah, and I actually got this with the Millennium Falcon because I uh, I bought more than $150 worth of stuff, obviously. 
So, uh, yeah. Up here we have, I think it's like the Scavenger. I'm not so sure if that's what it's called. It's from the Lego Star Wars series on um, Disney that they started. I don't even know the characters' names. I just bought it because I really like this uh, this ship. Like, if you just look at that, that's actually really cool. I like it. That's why I bought it, obviously, because I like it. Um, in here, we just have some miscellaneous stuff. Like, there's a police car. Let's see if it'll... F it just focuses on that. You can probably see it now. Back there's a police car. There's a car. There's, like, a... If I have the keys, I can't. I don't even know where they are. That wasn't the keys, but... Uh, there's, like, a police motorcycle. There's, like, Lego... Lego... The Lego movie stuff. And then just a random race car. In here, we have a little news mock. Like, it's, like, a murder scene. You have, like, cops, and you have a guy interviewing the police chief. We have the mystery machine. And two battle packs back there from, like, 2010, 12. I don't even know. Been a long time. Now, down here, we have a dirt bike uh, trailer that's being pulled by a Jeep. And we have a Mandalorian set. The, uh, the, dar the dark Mandalorian gunship or something like that. And I have two of these, which were Mandalorian battle packs that came with little turrets in them. That's just a little car I made. Alright. On to the bigger crap. So, over here we have Anakin Snowspeeder, which is this white one. I got that back forever ago. Uh, next we have Anakin Custom Jedi Starfighter. Can't remember if it's custom Jedi Starfighter. I think it's just Jedi Starfighter, because this is custom Jedi Starfighter, which is this one. This is still Anakin's when he was younger. We have Plo Koon's Jedi Starfighter. We have a V-wing, and we have a Naboo Starfighter. Up here we have the Imperial Star Destroyer. It's this is actually smaller than the Millennium Falcon over there that I showed you. It's a, this is actually the original one, so that's cool. Next we have the Han Solo and Carbonate. Freezer set, chamber, not freezer, chamber set. It comes with Boba Fett, a little midget guy, and then obviously Han Solo. This is actually a printed minifigure. I quote minifigure because uh, it was made with the original slave, not the original slave one, but like Boba Fett's slave one, that first set when that came out. This was the piece they used. It was called a minifigure, but uh, next we have the Imperial Landing Craft. Uh, my dad actually built this with pieces that he found in those buckets over there and, you know, the boxes I showed in the other videos. Next we have right here is the Emperor Palpatine's um, shuttle, the his original shuttle, not, it, you know, not the other ones that he's had. I got that a while ago too. That it feels like just yesterday I was building these sets. Next, right here, there's more parts to this. I just don't know where they are. This was a Sith, like the original Sith. Um, what's it called? Like battle pack. I can't remember what it was called. If you guys know, just leave a comment. Next, we have an ATST from Star Wars Rogue One. This set was $31. This is probably one of my favorite sets. Just, I mean, the First Order set is really one of my, is, is my favorite because it's in the glass case. But this is also one of my favorite sets because it, I've never had an ATST and I've, I, it just, they just fascinate me. I call them chicken walkers. But, uh, next we have the ATDP, which actually looks more like a chicken. This is from Star Wars Rebels. Actually, this was... Yeah, this was in Star Wars Rebels. Um, it still is in there, but it was mainly in like the first season that you saw this. It's a really big set, actually. Next, we have the Slave 1, the 2013 version. This is actually a really nice set. If you guys want a review on this, just let me know, because I will definitely do a review on any of these sets, but I would really like to do one on this, because I have the original guys and everything for it. Let's see if I can get this, because I'm not that tall. Next, we have an ARC-170 fighter. I think this is the original one. Same thing with the Y-Wing. Obviously, pieces are missing. Uh, 
those are really cool sets. And next we have the T-16 Skyhopper. This I got in the summer as well. I got a lot of sets in the summer. That is cool looking. Look at that. Alright, and it's not the... No, this is actually not lastly. I don't know if you guys will be able to see this because I don't have a light. But this is that mock that was shown in William's channel. Uh, the main sets in here are the troop transports. Which is those two, these two things that you see right here. And next we have the A-Wing versus the Darth Vader's advanced TIE fighter. And then we have the Ghost over here. Or the Phantom. Is it the Phantom? Yeah, it's the Phantom. I really want the Ghost. I sadly was not able to get it when it was when it came out. I wanted it for Christmas, but I think I got Jabba's Palace and a couple other sets that year. It was like 2014 or 2015, I can't remember. And I don't know if you'll be able to see this. This is just a broken rocket set that I got way back for my birthday in like 2010. Alright, and over here. Oh my goodness. We have a spider droid. And we have a anti-tank gun droid. Or anti-tank droid. And there's a mini spider droid. And then we have a bark speeder and a... A Jedi speeder. Next, we have two Gungan star sh uh, starfighters. We have the battle on Silicamai. Um, we have a Utapau droid, and two Genyushian corporate, no, not Genyu, two corporate alliance tanks. And I think they're. You see those two white speeders back there? Those are from battle packs. My friend, like from forever ago, and he used to have um. When I used to have sleepovers at my house for parties we would sleep out in the tent i actually got one for my parents and then he got me one so that was too late he's like do you want me to return i said no it's fine but uh yeah i think i honestly did everything it's a lot of legos but it's definitely worth it and i'm still growing on my lego collection but uh definitely leave a like comment down below if you like this video um if you have any advice to give me just let me know and definitely subscribe. We're almost hitting 30. It's only been a week, and I've almost hit 30, and that's crazy. But definitely, guys, I'll see you guys later. Peace.